system in life. 41, 42, 43. Hello and welcome to another awesome Wednesday morning. And guess what? It's Arms Day in Destiny. How's everybody doing? Great. Alright. You know me. Everybody's favorite gamer is for your mega here. Bring you Arms Day loadouts. Now let's check out what Benji has for us today for our orders from last week. Alright, first up we got the Soros ARI 41. Let's check out. Ooh, that one has hidden hand. All right, let's check out the perks. Let's see if it comes with our favorite site. <coughs> SLO12, SPO28, the hollow site, one of my favorites. Soros, well not Soros, SRO37, <laughs> brain fart. All right, this one comes with Hammer Forge, great. Appendage Magazine, not bad. Snapshot, small bore. Starting to like it here. Hammer forge, small bore. Holy <laughs> hidden hand with target acquisition. And hollow sights with target Oh definitely getting this one. Definitely getting this one. Small bore and rangefinder or hammer forge. Definitely getting that one. But just for little giggles, let's check out the other ones. SLO19, SPO28, another one with a hollow sights. Nice. SRO41. Alright, we got fitted stock, feather mag, snapshot, reinforced barrel, and persistence. Not bad. Persistence, fitted stock, either reinforced barrel or snapshot. This is a good one too. But highly recommend that first one. <laughs> highly recommended. Alright, SLO SLO nineteen SPO twenty six mm, SRO forty one. Not bad. High caliber rounds, appendage magazine, speed reload, hand laid stock. Ooh, take a knee. No thank you. I'm taking that first one. One when hit in hand and the hollow sights. Had these with us at Twilight Gap. Wiped pretty bad there. Really? You wiped pretty bad there? I forgot how to pronounce this fusion rifle. The Desan? Desan? Desan. Well, there'll be a lot of comments saying how to pronounce it correctly, but alright, let's check it out. Alright, this one comes with a candle, IS-2, torch, HS-2. Alright, this one comes with a um, hot swap, snapshot, hand laid stock, not bad. But I don't like to lose the range on it. Unflinching, Eye of the Storm. Probably hits like a mad truck. Let's see, rank two. Spark IS6, Torch HS2. This one comes with Replenish, Single Point Sling, Injection Mold, Underdog, Eye of the Storm. Mm. Mm. Candle IS2, Torch HS2, not bad. Replenish. Ooh, accelerated coils, that's a good one. Oil frame, unflinching, danger close. Hmm, refill when the super happens. Accelerated coils, unflinching. It has high stability and unbelievable impact. That it really does need the accelerated coils, but I wish it gave it a little bit more of an oomph. But I, I may actually take this one. 
because of the accelerated coils. I was thinking of the first one because it has something similar. It has hot swap to get the accuracy, snapshot to get the aim, hand late stop to give it perfect stability, but I lose on range. But the <laughs> accelerated coil is much neater with this one. The guy Hershus D hand cannon. Let's see. True sights IS. Steady hand IS. Danger close. Feeding frenzy. Hand loaded. Armor piercing rounds. Small bore. Not bad with small bore. It could be better. A lot better. Let's see. True sight, steady hand, relentless tracker, final round, hand loaded, armor piercing rounds, oil frame. Uh, true sight, sure shot. Army of one, not bad. Fading frenzy is a decent one. Let's see, hand loaded. Really hand loaded? It doesn't even change the range. High caliber round, small bore. Turn into a straight six shooter. Small bore, fitting frenzy, army of one. Actually, this is probably the best out of all three. So I'm going with uh, the third one, <coughs> rank three. For the hand cannon. Try it. See how it feels. That thing oiled, Guardian. All right, let's do a quick swap to the Warlock. Grab our other two weapon orders, which I believe is gonna be the Artemis D and the Zarinaya D. Let's see if we can find a question from the Twitter. Because apparently people love answering or love getting their stuff answered during the Arms Day loadout. Okay, here's one. How are you enjoying the Iron Banner this week? I'm enjoying it pretty well. I had a good day with playing with my friends yesterday. Hopefully in a few hours we'll get that rolling. I'll probably get the broadcast and live stream on Twitch today. I was having some problems with it yesterday. Are you planning to do any videos for Division? I was thinking doing build videos, weapons like I kind of do here. But not right now. The state of the game is so glitchy. Too many freaking glitchers and cheaters. Hmm. Alright, I'll see what I think, Banshee. Getting cold out there. Artemis D. Yeah. Let's see. We got the good hollow sights. We got the LB assault sights also. Okay, last resort. Spray and play. Snapshot. Fitted stock. Brace frame. Not bad with a brace frame. Spray and play. Not bad. Great for PvP with the last resort, but let's see. Before we do the final judgment, let's check out the other ones. GA post sites with the LC range. Relentless tracker, not bad. 
Focus fire. Alright. Not bad. Snapshot. Hand loaded. Brace frame. They'll come with brace frame. That'd be super, super awesome. But look at that impact though. Third one. H. SC hollow sight or hollow lens or hollow sights. LD watchdog. We got hot swap, spray and play, snapshot, speed reload, and brace frame again. Brace frame. Spray and play, hot swap, bonus accuracy, actually pretty good. Bonus actually accuracy and stability, yes please. Oop, wrong button. Alright, now we got the heavy hitter one. Let's see. GA post sites with the SD thermal, SD thermal is a real good site. Uh, crowd control, focus fire, and did I just run out of batteries? What the hell? Okay, there you go. Snapshot, fitted stock, brace frame, not bad. Got brace frame, focus fire, crowd control. Next up, okay, GB iron sights with the LB assault sights. This one comes with crowd control, rodeo, snapshot, hand loaded, and brace frame. If brace frame is a recurring perk, that's an awesome one. Brace frame. Not bad, it's looking good for rank 2 so far. Alright, let's see rank 3. GA post sites again with the LC range. Army 01, not bad. Persistence, yeah, that's a good one. Snapshot, speed reload, brace frame. <laughs> brace frame, persistence, and Army 01. Get your May laser grenade cooker, have a freaking laser beam. I actually may pick the third one. Either two or three is a good one, but I already want to try the persistence on this one. Did the switch flip on my LE controller? Yeah, that fits. Alright, and we got a bonus fusion rifle. I didn't know I picked up one. I remember I got the one with accelerated coils. Let me pick this one then and test the two out. It's under the cloak, okay. Alright, alright. The field test weapons of this week. Alright, we got an auto rifle to use in the crucible. Oh. We gotta make uh, precision shots with a uh, auto rifle. We could use that in PBE. All right, it looks like we got a hand cannon using the crucible. A hand cannon to get double kills in PVE, and another hand cannon to use against the Vex. So we got one for Vex, double kills, and precision for PVE, and we got an auto rifle and a hand cannon to use in PVP. Not bad. All right, let's check out foundry orders for next week. All right, we got the Soros ARI 41 auto rifle. We got the Soros ARI 45. So we got the 41 and 45. Nice. We got the Lumia Lumidia. I can't pronounce these. Lumidia D pulse rifle from Hake. Not bad. Ooh, we got Soros PDX 45 pulse rifle from Soros. Nice. And the JLB-42 rocket launcher for next week's orders. Definitely get the PDX-45. 
And the auto rifles. Just get these three. Soros, Soros, Soros. Now just choose whatever you guys want. But I highly recommend the two auto rifles, the pulse rifle, another pulse rifle, and the rocket launcher. <laughs> Alright. Well, thanks for watching. Enjoy this armed days loadout. I sure did. Thanks for watching.